Back to playing the Pokemon card game. Spunky. He's fun. Okay. Let's continue. If I can remember the buttons. So we're finishing up the first dungeon today. But you know what? It would be smart if I put the chat on my cell phone, because then I can see it right in front of me instead of looking over. Dungeon. Also, am I supposed to be getting a bottom bar on my screen or no? Bottom bar? Like, I can see your uh, recording software on my Jeez, screen. Yeah, it's the only way to do another. it right now. This is oh, okay. really bad for my Sorry heart. Sorry about that. No, you're good. I just know it was, it was something wrong. I might test some other stuff out another day. We're not done yet. Hurry, let's speed it up. Give me one second. Just pop in I the forgot chat about that the phone. Phone. I forgot about that horrible thing. <laughs> Apparently, I've been told you can definitely tell later on in the game this is done by the guys that did AI summon them. Shinigami, you might be fine because you're floating around, but this is really tough for me. Ah. Drop my phone. I can't believe But you have that. a cape. He had the corpse hidden under the blanket? So, that four-eyed detective was sleeping next to a dead body. I'm so jealous! I mean, it is a god of death. Burn I'm it. gonna pretend I didn't hear that. Zilch was lying in bed with the corpse. He got up once the smoke screen was ready. He took the corpse out from under the blanket, pulled the knife out of the cushion, and stabbed it. That way, even after he switched with the corpse, he could just hide to avoid me. Where did Detective Four Eyes hide after that? Under the bed? It must have been someplace with easy access. Oh, which I see. Must where. mean. Under the bed. He could have quickly hid there. Yeah, but with the fire, that would have been dangerous. Which means, if you checked under the bed at the time, you would have caught that four-eyed idiot. But back then, I was in such a hurry to warn the other master detectives. I'm sure he calculated all that, too. He knew I'd panic. Maybe he was planning to take advantage of you from the very beginning, and that's why he let you live. Yeah. I think Zilch was the one who peeked into the restroom while I was sleeping there. I was supposed to be sleeping in the infirmary, so he must have planned to move me before committing the crimes. I passed out in the restroom, but that didn't hinder his plans, so he went with it. Speaking of which, wasn't it Detective Four Eyes who told you to go to the first car? Yeah. He must have planned to make me witness everything and set me up as the culprit. Aha! I think I'm starting to see the whole picture now. Not bad, Master. Maybe you were a big shot detective before you lost your memories. No. If I really was a great detective, I would have caught the culprit in the infirmary before any of this happened. I guess so. By the way, where did he get the corpse he was hiding in the blanket? That corpse? Well, um... Right on board with him. From Corpse R Us. <laughs> the easiest way to get corpses. I do like the changing dungeon. It's still one of my favorite things so far. I won't let you go any further! If I do this now, it does not change it the way I was hoping. Dang it! Hmm, getting in our way again, huh? I forgot that weirdo existed. you stand against my ruthless <laughs> master, been a little while since he'll chop you up and stir fry you with veggies for dinner! I will not!
I need to remember the fight controls, dang it. We don't, we are, should not take breaks from this game. So welcome everybody, I can see you guys in the chat. Master, I'm lending you a hand from here on out. I'll assist you when you're in a pinch. Huh? Assist? It's the rule of the Mystery Labyrinth to assist whoever you're accompanying. Now let's go, Master. Looks like you might not need assist after all, Master. Just give me a BFG 9000 and shut up. This could be the clincher. <laughs> mystery Phantom Statements won't inflict any doubt. Ooh. I won't let you pass! Enough of your nonsense! I have to remember how to play. With a corpse? It'd be impossible to switch like that. No, what Someone who could replace Silt would need to be the same size as him. He didn't have a bag that could carry a corpse. Nobody did have a bag to carry a corpse if you cut it up. It'd be impossible to get it on board. There was no. No more sake for you. Nonsense. That's not the one I want. Hmm. Yeah, yeah, huh? I do. Ba -ba. I won't let you. Yeah, Monkey. Maybe that's yes. enough of your nonsense. Well, did I do but you are down. Don't talk to me about nonsense. You think he swapped with a corpse? It'd be impossible to switch like that. Someone who can replace Silt would need to be the same size as him. He didn't have a bag that could carry a corpse. Dang it! Why am I getting that time now? It'd be impossible to get it on board. There was no corpse to replace anyway. I hit that. Master. Dang it! Yeah. I won't let you pass. Enough of your nonsense. How do I think he swapped with a corpse? Right. It'd be impossible to switch like that. I press the wrong Someone who can replace Silt. Yes, I am. Oh, I same have been. I'm an idiot. Okay, I have been hit. He didn't have a bag that could carry a corpse. Master, you don't need more sake. I switch. I had the two buttons switched in my head. Master. Maybe enough for a bag to carry a body. In that case... Because of the sake. Already a corpse on the train, there wouldn't have been a point to bringing in one from the outside. Okay. I won't let you pass! There. Enough of your nonsense! Hmm? That 
That's right. Okay, so I do have the right one. I just need to get the right stick. I won't let you. Hell oh, yes. Heat up is weird. Planning on it. Yeah, I got the you think he swapped with a corpse? Yes. It'd be impossible to switch like that. Someone who can replace Silt would need to be the same size as him. He didn't have a bag that could carry a corpse. It would have been got at the station. It'd be impossible to get it on board. There was no corpse to replace anyway! Got it. This is the truth! Oh my gosh, this controller is vibrating like crazy. Look at the little zippers! There's no need to bring an extra corpse for the swap. He just needed to reuse a dead body on the train. It's Aphex's body from the fifth car! He and Zilch are nearly the same height and both have stab wounds in their chests. So the corpse that was switched was Aphex's! Ah, damn it! How could someone like you find the truth? Truth! Reminds me of the new Pokemon game, honestly. Oh my god, it sounds like Nerd Wonder. We can push that evil on me, Mommy. Do you ever want to torture her? Can I do this to her frequently in, in streams? Just tell her if she sounds like a Funimation voice actress. Ow. At some point, she's going to stop finding. Me. Oh, she does not like it when I do that. Even if that's true, don't let your guard down. The mystery labyrinth isn't over yet. Stay alert until the very end. To be fair, do you know how many people say I sound like 15 other voice actresses and they like accuse me of having other channels? I don't know. It's weird. I have people who say they've never heard a voice like mine. I never uh, had others say like, oh, you must own this channel and this channel and this channel. Like, I don't know who those people are. Uh, all right. The answer to that question is yes, of course I do, but subscribe to this channel, it's new, here! <laughs> yes! Wow, who would have thought that short-tempered idiot would be used for a body swap? Anyone that wanted to kill him because he was annoying. Thinking back, the reason the corpses in the first and fifth cars were burnt was to switch them out. But the corpse was so badly burned that I couldn't tell it was Aphex. That must be what the necklace was for, so I could identify him. Well, reusing a corpse is rather environmentally friendly of the culprit, don't you think? It totally went green. I mean, we gotta recycle everything in our day and age, so you gotta get the most value out of corpses too, you know? Hmm. Yes, I've been meaning to make this our Saturday game again. It's just been Baldur's Gate kept us busy. By the way, everyone clipped you getting killed by me, and I'm sorry for that. Damn it. <laughs> what made it worse is that I immediately got killed by accident right after that. Uh, <laughs> All I wanted to do was push him. You look like a zombie. <laughs> Yes, I do, because I'm gonna get Yankee. That's how it works. Wait, I am not the culprit. Or are you? I am a victim who was already killed. Give a feather on you. So, leave me alone! Can you die? Hey, he ran away! We're gonna find After out. Him, master? It, yeah. All right, looks like someone's going under a train. The first car's infirmary wasn't me, but Aphex? 
But you went to car five after car one, and discovered his corpse there. How was the corpse transported from car one to car five? That'd require moving past you. That's right, if you Just tell me who the fuck killed someone on this damn train! Otherwise, I will murder all of you! I hope I'm doing this right. I actually don't know. I mean, I'm assuming so? Yeah, okay, you can't go any good. faster. I've tried every button. Uh, well, there's the... Oh, yeah, he's just at the front of the train. Is he gonna go boss mode? Is he going super instinct? What if she, if she, like, gets hit by, like, a subway sign or something, like, while you're riding that, will she just go through it? This is completely uh -huh. anime, so maybe. Like... Damn it! Now we're in a psychic realm of bullshit. We've been in a psychic realm of bullshit. We're in a bigger psychic realm of bullshit. Hey, do you want the little figure they've made of him? Two pathways. Where did he run off to? Why can't I see it the right way around? When moving the body from car one to car two, the culprit... Oh, fuck you. It's a good thing I can actually read backwards without a problem. Did not move... Uh... Moved through the... He didn't. Another mystery that needs oh. to be solved. I did that for no reason, okay. Also, if there's a bit of an echo, sorry, I'm in a different spot than I normally am. Damn it, why God? I'm gonna try this side. You have admitted your hypothesis is bullshit. If you lose! If outside the train instead of through it, he could have passed us. Well, no. Know. That's impossible. Don't help me. Impossible. 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 You can impossible. shut up. Impossible. I think impossible. I got a bad end. Impossible. 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 Oh, he's going to a BDSM club. Better, he's part of KISS. What the fuck am I watching? Zilch turned into a mystery phantom! Get it, master! Boot now we have to kill this fucking thing. No, legit, he looks like he comes from KISS. Look at him. No, no, KISS never had pink. Or purple. It was always I just silver and black. Them. They already have one that looks like a fucking cat. I know, that's what I think it might be a reference to. I hope not. Alright, let's kill him. We know what crimes he's committed. <laughs> Fuck to the person that sent me that DM. How can you read backwards you can't read forward? Oh wow. my god, it is, it is Kiss. You're that right, was fucking kiss. mean. It is Kiss. My friend just sent me a message. How the hell can you read backwards? Train. You can't even read forward. Did you think the corpse was brought in from outside? The windows are all locked shut. The door's locked when the train is moving. Cut me, Mick. We know the train never oh. stopped once. If the windows and doors are shut, there's no way to get out while the train is moving. No issues occur during the train's operation. Got it! Got it! This is the truth! No, there was something strange. The black God, and shaking that weird. happened when I was in car Which two one? and car four. The guy. Oh my god, look oh my at his god. hair. The little thing does actually change yeah. with it. Oh. Or is it just the angle we're viewing it? No, no. They're, that's an. You're echoing, by the way. 
Damn! Yep, pop out, pop back in. Maybe one of these enemies are going. Yeah, I know. They're I figured they were all going to be kids. I figured out a while ago they were all going to be kids inspired. We're almost done with this dungeon. We couldn't finish it last time because we were going too long. Don't forget, guys, you can donate and sub and stuff and help out the channel as always. I do want to say hello to Crash, who is watching and working, who is a very awesome artist. You guys should all check out the new Venture Brothers movie, which he did the uh, some of the design work for, which we still need to watch. It hurts really good. When the blackout occurred and the shaking started, I'm certain something else happened in the train. Maybe it has something to do with the mystery of the moving corpse. That sounds like a book title. <laughs> Don't be stupid! So what if there was a little blackout and some gentle swaying? Whoop your ass! Distorted plate, blood... Okay, Forget well, the shaking in the... Backup control is gonna definitely be blackout. it. Blackout! They were not a coincidence! The blackout was just a bad contact. Flash through this mystery. Oh, you can use the long range one to break those? Yeah, I figured it out. I've been using the wrong button. No, the blackout didn't occur because of a connection failure. It was due to the main control system failing and switching to the backup control system. Creepy fucking purple floating ball. The blackout occurred during that one second when the system switched over. Wait till we do Dangnarampa and you meet Monokumo. <laughs> Which people are very excited to see a reaction to that series. I don't want to fight a train, fuck! Hey! You ran away! A fleeing phantom is a bad phantom! Is there such a thing as a good phantom? After him! You gotta keep solving the mystery and boom kill that mystery phantom! You, you didn't answer the question, though. She doesn't care! Run! Like, we have a choice. We don't. Choice is an illusion. Master, you may know the cause of the blackout, but what does that have to do with how the corpse was moved? The failed main control system was in car one, where the body swap occurred. If so, then the main control system's failure must have something to do with moving the corpse. So maybe the culprit broke the main control system. He must have attempted to stop the train to bring in the corpse from the outside. But the train never stopped. The operation log confirms the train was moving the entire time. Okay, I think I figured this out. You know how the train stopped when we went in, or kind of went black when we went into the tunnel? Yes. The corpse was already there waiting. So all right. he had to do is get a window open, grab it, and pull it in. So I don't think he broke the system to bring the corpse in. Then why did the main control system fail? Hmm. It must have something to do with moving the body. But you're unsure exactly how, huh? In that case? Will it ever end? Oh god, I don't ah! need to see this. Fuck you, man. This is Indiana Jones bullshit. The mystery is blocking you. Anything blocking you in here is also a mystery. So let's solve it to keep on going. Oh, for the love of God! Yeah, they weren't kidding about this being a long dungeon, Jesus. It's mystery inception. This is your kind of thing, though. You love mysteries. I like puzzles. They're kind of the same thing. I guess I like mysteries. You like puzzles. Writing mysteries. Writing mysteries is fun. Ah!
Stop! Ow. Would you stop cutting our neck? Stop slicing me open. So this is the question we're facing right now. Control panel was lost when car one was. The main control system must have failed because something happened in the first car. If that's true, what exactly happened? Well, mm -hmm. Lost if a he's, bunch of if he, ha we don't know if he actually has powers, right? He said if he does have powers, it's controlling animals. Could he have sent? No, no, no. We, we, we know he. No, we know he has power. Oh, no, we oh, have oh, not seen his guy. powers yet. The cat ear guy, right? Yeah. yeah. So theoretically, if he still has his powers, even though he's a traitor, he could have sent rats to mess with the wires, which would have caused a failure in the control system, and caused the backup. Was that his power? Yeah, it was controlling animals. If it's related to the body being moved, then how? Hmm. He summoned Plus the swarm of ants so to move the body from one car to another. You must be thinking hard. I really hope we get a flashback if that's the answer. Or well, he just his tied it to a cougar. I better think hard too. <laughs> Don't that's shit yourself. <laughs> the main control system failing. The blackout? The train shaking? I do really like her dress, though. Oh, yeah! Why did the train shake like that? There was a blackout right before entering the tunnel that was caused by the main control system failing. But the culprit didn't destroy it, so the blackout happened because... He messed with something. Uh... Oh, uh, wasn't there some shaking right before the blackout, too? After the whole train shook, the blackout... You need to shut up right now! I don't get it! That's right! The train shook right before the blackout. We still don't know what caused that to happen. Whatever it was, it was strong enough to make the entire train shake. The derail. It caused the main control system to fail and resulted in a blackout. Theoretically, could one of these trains derail and just put itself right back on the rails? Because that, if it would have uh, derailed, it wouldn't have kept going. It depends if it's a partial derailment. Maybe that could have been. Usually, it. no. Yes. Yeah, well, yeah, we know what happens with a full derailment. This is also a bullet train, so I don't really know if that would be completely different. Oh uh, yeah, it's probably maglev. So yeah, there is no track. If it had something to do with moving a body, then what must have happened was... Ooh! Did I give you the assistance you needed? Close to solving the case now? Shut up! That it's time to combine our powers and solve this thing! Let's go, Master! Lay it all out! I just want to see him smack her and tell her to shut up for a second. Give it to that. Also, to jiggle. Mm-hmm. They do like the jiggles. Okay. Let's together as a team. Twirling, twirling, twirling. Oh, go, go. Ooh. Okay, so D. That's not it. E. All right, let me try. Give me a second for it to pop up. Are you a No, it couldn't be derailed. Okay, it's gotta go in order. Detached. I think there's a T on the bottom coming up. Yep. Do this. I failed. Yeah. People that didn't watch the first two episodes or the, see the first two streams are very confused. Embrace the confusion. I guess we were right. It did detach and then reattach. You know, it, it's anime logic. 
Master, I don't care. The cause of the blackout. Oh, please don't make me go through this whole if thing. So. so he must have. But the, so I don't think. Skip, skip, mm. skip. But you're. Yep. Welcome to visual novels, folks. My Detach God. equals ah. derail. Yeah. I know. I knew it. anything. Oh, hold on! I forgot to meet my other computer. Ah! my butt. Stop so this me. is the question we're facing right now. The main if that's tr if it's from hmm. Masters. Yeah, they're not up yet so on serious. uh they're up for members Who right now. Well, they're gonna go up the after um, oh, yeah. Why? There a little a bit more of the other series. Called... Oh, oh wasn't the... That's right. The, whatever it it caused. The, if it had some. Ooh, that it's. Let's go. I still can't believe I was. Uh, yeah, I know. Episode two is up for for members right now. I want to get a few more episodes oh, done before. Yeah. Yeah. There we go. E e. That's right. Hey. On the lower part. It's not A. It's T. Great! Now A. Go, go, go! Now C. Great! H. Go, go, go! And E, D. Erectile dysfunction. <laughs> Damn. What the fuck, lady? <laughs> Why can you fire lasers from At your face? At least she's not throwing up anymore. At least Vomit would be normal. Could it be that the first car was separated from the train? Huh? Separated? What? Seriously? Yeah. The reason why the main control system failed was because... the first car was cut off from the rest of the train we were riding in. Let's keep going for now. Yeah, but we were able to go from the first car to the other cars. That means it would have had to reattach itself. Um, Master, I don't really get it. What do you mean the first car was cut off? Unless it's just the programming. The shaking happened just before the blackout, right? Huh? Did it just shake? What was that? The lights went out for a moment and came back on. At that time, the first car was disconnected from the rest of the Amaterasu Express. As a result, the main control system failed, and after a brief blackout, it switched to the backup. But why cut off the first car? Why go through all that trouble? Because fuck you. Of course, to move the body in the train car. To do that. I, I think they did it because in Japanese it's probably a lot less uh, letters. The kanji is a lot less, so they just had to put the ed together. Since you know words are different in each language, so sometimes you get that. God damn it! Stop dropping boulders. Where do you get these things? It's a there ghost it realm. It's bigger than ever. Where do you get ghost boulders? Ghost Mountains? Where are the ghost mountains? How much mountains? longer will this keep happening? Just past the train? I feel like I'm going to suffocate. Let's go to the ghost mountains. I do want to go to the ghost mountains. Now's not the time to be suffocating! Then we can see the ghost buffalo. <laughs> Again? Stop cutting me! We need to resolve the mystery at hand. Given that the first car was cut All right, off, get back so in your fucking barrel. 
Right. I think I see what happened. Seems like you got it. Let's do this. Lay it all out, Master. I know, Jack. I'm kind of figuring it out. Back to this. You want to go to the ghost beach? Yeah. Let's work together as a Three team. letters. The A is definitely in there somewhere because that's the only feeling. It's not bad. It has, it has but the, the first letter. Car! Car! Oh, yep. <laughs> do, do we have a C? Yeah, we do. Great. A. Nice. And R. Nice. At least it's there kind of go. forgiving with the shooting, the aiming. Yeah. There was a modeler having a lot of fun with this. Yes, there was. I don't want you to keep shooting lasers out of your face. It's weird. <laughs> All right, let's go kick his ass. That's right. He transported the corpse using the entire first car. That's why the first car was disconnected. Transported the corpse? With the entire car? Nonsense. What oh the God, fuck? He did evolve. Oh no. I was joking about the Ultra Instinct thing. We oh, might actually get that. Man. No. The first car is at the front of the train. Cat bird man. Yeah, but depending on which way the train goes, it can also be the last car. Aphex's corpse was in the fifth car, in the back. Even if you detach the front car, how do you move it all the way to the rear? Uh, um... <sighs> you suck, man. Master, don't be scared. Lots of villains transform after they've been cornered. C calm down. Stay calm. Think. Uh, how could you swap the position of the first and fifth cars? Fuck you, magic? If I can answer that, I can solve this mystery once and for all. How did it happen? That reminds me. It's gonna be something me. overly top of Earlier, crazy. when you were talking about the shaking and mentioned the blackout? Yeah, the thing I remember is when it was, um, they pointed out earlier in the game when it's going one way, the last car would be the first car. When it's going back the other way, the la the la the car that yeah, but here's the thing though is he like so stupid that he doesn't he didn't realize the change in momentum of the train. Probably yeah, he was too focused on getting away with it. God, he's dumb. Well, look at how many people look at how many criminals are caught by the smallest of things. That is not a small thing. <laughs> I'm sorry, that's just like that would have been obvious. Like oh hey, the train just switched directions. <laughs> Blackout only happened once, but the shaking happened twice. Probably messed with it twice while we were unconscious. See, he can easily move the body while we were unconscious if he had killed everybody. Like know. I said, I, I just feel like there's going to be something that's a lot more complicated than what they explained. Yeah, it definitely shook two separate times. Right before entering the tunnel, and right after leaving it. And remember, this is only the first mystery in this game. I know. I know. The first time was when the train car was disconnected. But what about the second? Something happened to the train then, too. The shaking at the end of the tunnel felt similar to when car one disconnected. There's no point thinking about it. You're stuck in this labyrinth. For all eternity! Master, here it comes! You gotta solve the mystery and defeat him! Your deductions are Can I are start off that, that eternity by eating you? You just walk up and stab him in the face. Because they're all. No, I want to eat him for dominance. From the very beginning! <laughs> you can just chew on his wings while he's alive and stare right in his face. 
No, I'll just do it with Sabertooth, dude. Oh god. <laughs> yes, yeah, that's the whole thing. He was knocked out during that time, so depending on when he killed the others, it would have been easy to move the body. I do really like that design work. Let's see so it shook like. twice near the tunnel. What of it? You mean the train car was separated and reconnected? Why would that even matter? Even if you managed to separate car one, how could it be moved to the rear? The train was always running on the same tracks. There's no mm, way was it? to shuffle the train cars around. Oh, yeah, there is. There is. That's the one we needed. True. Okay, now I know. For now. I think it's that. I think it's. Okay, here's the route map. The route map. Yeah. So where is... Yeah, it could have easily switched routes. I think it's this one. Oh, it shook twice near the tunnel! What of it?! You mean the train car was separated and reconnected? Why would that even matter?! Even if you managed to separate car one, how could it be moved to the rear? The train was always running on the same tracks. No, it was not. There's no way to shuffle the train cars around. Oh, I think I hit the wrong one. No, did I? I got the right one. Yeah. No. At that time, not all the cars were moving on the same track. The track that the Amaterasu Express was on separated into double tracks right before entering the tunnel. So by taking advantage of the double tracks, it's possible to switch out the train cars. So it was right. Kind of. I'm gonna stab you now. The first time the train shook was before entering the Hello. tunnel, which was caused by car one separating. After that, the separated car one entered the other track, while the rest of the train proceeded on the main track. Remember how it said originally that the what would have been car five, they kept saying you couldn't get it open, and then we could suddenly get it open? Yeah. That must have been why. The two tracks rejoin after the tunnel. That's where car one connected to the end of the train. This is when the train shook for the second time. You're right! The first car moved all the way to the back! Your haircut's still <laughs> shitty. <laughs> Not as bad as this, though. Normally, it's impossible for a single train car to function on its own. But the Amaterasu Express is special. The control system will supply electricity as programmed and drive the train. But all train cars on the train have motors that run autonomously. If each train car can operate autonomously, then car one can function on its own! Doesn't that solve everything? It's time you gave up! No! That's crazy! God, he's going into his third form. Huh? What? Vital form! Using your method to rearrange the train cars would connect the first car to the end. Which would leave it behind the fifth car. In other words, it becomes the sixth car, but that doesn't exist. So... You're telling me you found Aphex's corpse in the non-existent sixth car? Oh, you're right. Do you get it? You're the one who's wrong. 
Everything you've deduced is wrong! No, I'm not wrong. The truth lies just ahead of us. I will prove it to you! Just give me the barrel, Jugs. Oh my god. Let me start the Aaron Terrasso Express Twirl. was a blank car Like process of elimination? Yeah, basically what we're doing. Wait. Yep, I was right. Yeah, there wasn't a first car. We don't know if we were ever actually in the first car. Maybe the Yamaturasu Express or not. doesn't have five cars. What if there were only four cars to begin with? Because we couldn't get the fourth car's door open to look at the fifth car, so we don't know if it actually existed. If that's the case, then to me, car one could be made to look like car five. <laughs> huh? So. There weren't five cars the whole time, but instead, four? That's why Melanie said the fifth car's door was broken while we were in transit. See? That's what tipped me off to it, too. But you can't access the fifth car, the one at the end. The door appears to be broken and won't open. So, it wasn't broken. The fourth car was actually the farthest one back from the get-go? I'm sure the real fifth car was left behind at the station when we departed. So the train took off with only four cars. There was another car one at our destination. If it connected upon arrival, then the train would have five cars again. So the car one where I was knocked out became the fifth car at the end of the line. And when I was questioned by the peacekeepers, the car one there was another car prepared at the station specifically for this plot. If the real car one was waiting at the station's platform, then all the peacekeepers there would have noticed it. Yeah, but they're all in on this. So they were all in on it. Or you can assume that the peacekeepers themselves were the ones who prepared the other car one. <laughs> If there was another car one, then there will be something that sets it apart from the original car one. For example, the way the window glass was broken in the infirmary will be different from how I broke it. You mean when you use the fire extinguisher to smash the infirmary's window? So they knew you would do that? That's how they were able to imitate it in the new car one? I think I was set up to reach for that fire extinguisher. The fire extinguisher was left in a conspicuous spot in the hallway. They wanted me to use it to break the window. And that's how they pulled off swapping the first and fifth cars while in transit. It was all a trap to set me up as the culprit. Isn't that right? Zilch! Oh. All right, we're almost there. Come on, we we'll kill his ass. Let's go. Yeah, we're almost done with this. Well, with this part, we also do have the the uh, the novel too that we can look at. It, but I've been warned: don't read it until the end of the game. That was a pretty solid deduction. Mm -hmm. Very impressive. Of me for seeing your potential. It's so strange. It doesn't feel like I'm learning this stuff, more like I'm remembering it. Maybe I was even a high-ranking detective in a WDO. Now's no time or you're for a psycho. Still gotta catch him. 
Aren't most uh, right. most detectives? Yeah. They're just cocaine addicts. I was. If you weren't gonna say it, I was. Everything feels different here. But yeah, this is bad. This is just the calm before Sherlock the storm. Holmes. Be careful. You don't know what's gonna happen next. Other people. You know, making the first car look like oh, it was a really big trick to pull off. I'm surprised the train cars could disconnect and reconnect so smoothly. The train's automatic operating system must have had it programmed before we departed. Even the trick with the swapping train car? Yeah, that's why we couldn't have crawl. Probably. Out. It had to have been done automatically. Well, it'd be easy for Amaterasu. They own the train. That's what I'm worried about. Even if I obtain the truth here, won't they just ignore what I say and arrest me anyway? I keep telling you not to worry about it. As long as you have the truth, the culprit can't escape. Why are you so sure of that? You're actually almost done. You just did it. Go sleep, Ned. Now go sleep and you huggle your... Eventually we'll do Miko plushies so you guys can huggle Miko. What is this? Looks like uh, a fort to me. Fuck, people. About the plushie or the castle? With this kind of protection? Castle. I bet the truth is in there for sure. You just have to destroy it. So the truth is here. Are you going to turn me into a mech so I can destroy this castle? Oh uh, no, I have to fight him again. Fuck can't this have dude. the truth. Uh, that pose. I think he yeah, broke his back. Yeah, I was gonna say. I was gonna say. Yeah, that's a, that's a weird pose, man. I don't feel like that's comfortable, like, man. Like that's groin out, like back up, like you, you look like you're doing a really bad '70s dance. And your back is gonna hate you for it. It's impossible to destroy this fortress. Just give up and leave. A JoJo pose, yeah, actually. Whenever a culprit takes a last stand like this, you know we're just a step away from unriddling this labyrinth. Master, time gonna, to show him how him. dangerous you really are. After all, he did try to set you up. I'm not worried about that right now. We're so close to the truth. We gotta do this. <laughs> it's boom kill time! Oh god. Why are you going buggy? PC, what are you going buggy for? That's some funky shit. This is cool. The Shinigami's tutorial corner. To overcome the last stand of a phantom thief, tear through all obstacles in the mega-sized great onset destroyer of me. I'm Godzilla, fuck you. Yes! Let's do this, master! I love Japan. Never change your weirdness. What the fuck is going on? Last way the gigantic iron balls released from the Phantom's Fortress with a corresponding no kick. When the obstacle close in and the screen slows down, press the button to attack. What? Ooh. You're gonna be kicking some balls? I yeah. won't let you have the truth. Right in the nuts. Oh I bit damn. I see, I see. Racket to death! Blech. Okay. I just gotta get the timing for all this. Go away! Give up and scram! And remember that the buttons aren't I the same see. as the control for the computer. Easy, watch out! Your 
your deduction is wrong! Go away! Dang it. Don't come near me! Don't come any closer! That's Stop it! Switching the first and fifth cards is just your imagination! It's a I'm doing my best. Faceless lie. There's no Turn evidence the they wings. ever swapped! Yo! Check, check! Destroy! Come on, hurry up and decide! Use the solution key to smash through the wall, master! You're wrong! Huh? Come on! Got it! No! There are traces of a swap! The warped plate from car 5! The reason that plate was burned so thoroughly is because originally, it said car 1. Left as it was, it would have messed up your plot to make car 1 look like car 5. That's why you made extra sure it was burned beyond recognition! And you get like one of those terabyte cards for my Switch. That's nonsense. Why do I? I, I keep keeping that. I burned the. Okay, okay. I let it get too close. No, I didn't do that. Stop it! Stop! Go away! Get away from me! Wait! Get away! It just happened to be easily burned! But with it burned, you have no way of knowing what number car it was! She going for it! So there's nothing backing up your deduction! You have no I'm going to shove a ball up your that butt. location was the first car! Yeah, we are. Now it looks more like looks evil like can we need another solution key to boom kill him! Master. Okay, so you have a hard evidence providing location with Rumi and Car 5 Let's try that one. There is proof! The blood stain on the inner lock of the infirmary in Car 5! The culprit probably didn't notice it. But I remember! It's my blood! What? When I was trying to get into the infirmary in car one, I cut my finger on the glass. When I reached through to unlock the latch, I must have gotten blood on it. But that blood stain would have been hidden while the interlock was open. That's probably why the culprit missed it. My blood, which was left behind in car one, was found in car five. This proves that someone pulled off the car switching trick. This All right, let's beat the, the shit out of the case. Huh? Go, my big titted mech. <laughs> someone clip it. Oh, we sliced Birdman in the face. And we have finally do this. What we do to all furries. Completed the dungeon. Now we got to deal with the real world. I want AI Somnium three. Yes, so do I, and I want my Date. I want a Date figure. I want my Date figure. I'm not done yet. Oh, for the love of God, just die! If car one became car five, then where did the culprit supposedly hiding in the infirmary go? You had to have checked the fifth car, but the culprit wasn't there. He could have hidden any car after us once we ran out. That one's the easy one to explain. Finish his butthole. The culprit must have been hiding somewhere in the fifth car. Probably someplace safe.
We couldn't see him in main control A. Remember, we couldn't get it open? Mm. That would have been the easiest place to hide. Here. The culprit was hiding inside the main control room, which was locked shut the entire time. I didn't have the key, so I could never have gotten inside. I bet the culprit moved there from the infirmary while car one was running on the second track. If the train's management company, Amaterasu Corporation, was involved, the culprit may have had the key. And then they hid in a blind spot I couldn't see from the window. That's how they got past me. No. It's Just not me. I'm not. Honestly, how do you... Uh, well, I mean, maybe not for him, because he does look goofier than our main protagonist, but, like, if you were actually, like, looking at a normal person and didn't have cat ears growing out of your fucking head, like, to be busted by that fucking thing. With the, with the question mark hair. It's like, God well, damn it! Hit. <laughs> he seems like he's barely standing. All that's left is to finish him off. Finish him off? Uh, how do I do that? Drop your pants and grab your toes. And slash as hard as you can. Shove it in. Make it hurt. <laughs> <laughs> I couldn't resist it. If they clip it, I'll put it on the channel. I don't care. And we'll get flagged for dirty talking. Now the music is appropriate. Oh, damn it. You're gonna make me work on this. The, everything. Yep. the deduction is where the truth is made clear by thinking through all the deductions up until that point. Place the correct pieces in the... Okay, this fine. The There's only one truth. Okay. So I'm just gonna kind of look at this over for a minute. Barely boards the train. Yuma runs toward. Okay, what if I press? Okay, so this is. Press it to this ticket. Where did Yuma rush to? Okay, so we're okay. That thing there, because we're missing one? Yeah, I think that's where we have to put something to, to find it. Uh -huh. This would be so much better with a mouse, I am not gonna lie. Wait, oh, why are you playing this on PS5? Switch. Switch. Yeah, because right now, right now it's only out on Switch. I think after a year it'll come out on PC, because I think they have a, uh... So wait. Give me a I think this is one. Three. Three. Hopefully. I know for a fact that apparently AI Somnium 2 sold be way better than 1, so there is a very good chance. So bring me back, Dante. So we have to figure out where he but it's not showing here. Uh, How do I add something to this? Can I use that in? Okay. Oh, fuck you, that would have been better. You unlock these, I assume, with those like, ghost things. Yeah, I'm trying to figure out how. Matt, are you in the, in the chat? What did you, what did you press A? In? Oh, this is funky, the control. Come on. Can I put that there? Oh, okay. There we go. It's a little bit... This is, Like I said, this definitely would be better with a mouse. So we 
got that one. Ah, the drugs in the coffee. All right, so maybe we can't solve this one because we still have a couple of things locked here. We have the knife. We don't have anything that would be work useful for this. So it's definitely well, maybe, this one because I think he's holding the coffee cup. Well, that's the thing though, is like I'm noticing these and there's I think if we match more of them, there's gonna be a countdown, but those things are gonna unlock. lock. Oh, okay. So maybe we can solve another one. Yeah, let's go to the very end and come back from there. Okay, well. We okay, know. we don't have that one. one is... Which body was found last? Uh, that nope, was that's not what I want to hit. That was the torch one, which I think we have. That's the charred one. I think that was the one that was found last, wasn't it? Yep. Yep. Yep, you're right. That's how we do it. Yeah. And so then we have to do all of them in order to unlock, almost all of them, to unlock the last one, which is the eight. Let me just turn you up a smidgen. Okay, that makes a little bit more sense. Come on, computer, don't fucking Windows 8 is insane. And is it Windows 11? Or I'm sorry, Windows 11. I forgot what number we're at at this point. So did Microsoft. All right, so what's the answer? What are, which one are we trying to figure out here? The coffee. Okay. Yep. All right, there you go. Yeah, coffee. The coffee got drugged. That one we have everything, it looks like. So she's the only one that had alcohol. Yep. Figured the old man was gonna get a drink. Alright, there's two in here. It was used as a red herring, and we used the break the window. We know that. Right. The window yeah, is... that, that's, yeah, that's the fire extinguisher. We know that. And, and the red herring is the knife. Herring. Okay. Alright, so we have that thing there. Did we do two? Yeah, we got two. Every, everyone that isn't lit up with the pink is one we've done. Oh, okay. So one, five, five. Oh, thank you. Thank you. I, I'm i going to try to say your name. i sorry. I'm just going to say the first part of it. Cause it is it Lach? London? Lach London? Thank you. I kind of need that right now after what's been going on with the only fan. Where was the culprit hiding under the bed? Do we have that right there? Yeah, we have that. That way it is. Man, one, one wrong move and he could have gotten burned too. Because he set fire to the blanket. That's true. What is the culprit doing in the main control? And what happened? Yep. Car one. What happened when car one was detached? Nope. Yep, I know which one it is. I think it's still in there. Uh, the one that's right. The one that has the one on it. The one that's right next to the fire extinguisher. Okay. Nope. Nope. All right. So I know which one goes. Got that one. Okay, so that one's right. Let's. Mm. Oh, with the shaking. So it's the lower right hand corner. The, the when him looking around. The shaking is what happened when it got these Yeah, that's one. What did the call right there? Pants. Okay. 
We only got one choice left. And then it unlocks the final one. Yes. Alright. The final conclusion. It's Lachlan, but Lach is pronounced like lock. Oh. Okay. I try. He did yes, it like a bitch. We got it. We framed his ass. Was your hat alive? That's a good question. I wish we could ask him. Step right up. Alive. Step right up. Five master detectives slain before their time. And Amaterasu Corporation has master in their sights. Truth bombs are about to be dropped. Time for the deduction denouement. Oh dear God. The incident unfolded aboard the Amaterasu Express, which was on its way to Kanai Ward. I rushed onto the train as it was about to depart. At that time, the train was made up of five cars. You know what? We could totally get an Akira game if you get the right um, dev team. Like, make it really fuck like the manga. What? What, what would that? Would, the, would it actually just like be a visual novel, or would it be like you're just walking oh, down the road and it's just melting novel? people? Well, could could you or is it? Or is it you're just walking down the street and melting people as Tetsuo? You could do both. You could do like a visual novel type thing that they're doing here. Because the novels, there's, or the visual no, or not, fuck, uh, the mangas, there's what? The ambiances are what, 20? It's, like, it's, it's a like, huge series. The, yeah, I was gonna say, there's like a, over a thousand pages. And it's so messed up, that would be great. I'm surprised Japan hasn't tried to do that. Oh, because you were fast asleep in the Lost and Found, Master. If you'd kept snoozing, the case would never be solved. When the train started moving, it was only four cars long. The fifth and final one was left at the station. And so, the culprit's scheme had already begun. Meaning Amaterasu Corporation was involved from the get-go. Okay, you see. On the train, the master detectives were gathered together in car two. That was the dining car. Culprit had already mixed a knockout drug into every drink there. I bet the culprit who was the first person on the train, so they could prepare in advance and wait for everybody else. I felt unwell, and Melanie went to the trouble of pouring me a coffee. But after drinking it, I started to feel drowsy. I was hearing things at the time and thought that I might be seriously ill. But it was actually the drug. Oh, so you thought yours truly was responsible? Sticks and stones won't do much to a death god, but slander stings! The culprit sent me off to car one in order to frame me as the killer. I'm sure the culprit didn't expect you to get sick, Master, but... Since you look like a super easy target, probably changed their plan and went after you instead. Once I left, the other master detectives must have fallen asleep because of the drugged drinks. And then died. The culprit then burned everyone to death. Setting all those master detectives on fire! On purpose! What this is why you never now. trust a man with glasses. Or this furry. was when the culprit put the plan to frame me into motion. First, they carried Aphex's charred corpse to the infirmary in car one. The very first body we found. Then, they deliberately left a fire extinguisher near the restroom I was sleeping in. This was done to prompt me into smashing the door later. At least now we know that the ears are like, it, the ear hat is its own thing, but his hair looks like feathers. Someone get inside somehow, or else nobody would find the body. 
Next, the culprit entered the infirmary, locked the door, and laid down on the bed with Aphex's charred corpse. Jumping into bed with a charred corpse! And here I thought chivalry was dead! What a gentleman! I'm actually a little jealous. A knife and cushion created the red herring. Hell of a way to pretend to be dead. Furthermore, the culprit set the room on fire just as I was waking up. While you were sleeping, I felt someone come into the restroom. They must have seen me then and timed it. When I woke up in the restroom and went into the hallway, car one was beginning to fill with smoke. Oh, that's some precise timing! I caught a glimpse of Zelch in the infirmary with a knife lodged in his chest. But it didn't take long for the smoke to obscure everything. That was when the culprit took out Aphex's burnt corpse, switched places with it, and waited for me to enter the room while hiding beneath the bed. You sneaky bitch. It's just like a magic trick, a switching places under a veil of smoke. Meanwhile, I found the fire extinguisher on the floor, smashed the window, unlocked the room and went inside. Just like the culprit planned. And that's why they left the fire extinguisher there in the first place. After the smoke cleared, I found Zelch's body burnt to a crisp. At least, that's what I thought. The charred corpse was actually Aphex. The culprit had me completely fooled. That must have been why they picked the time-consuming method of roasting someone to death. Plus, the body was about the right size. I bolted out of car one after seeing the corpse. The culprit was under the bed at that time. They probably left at you from there, watching everything unfold like they planned. I went on to discover the charred corpses of the other master detectives. Around that time, the culprit came out from under the bed and went to the main control room in car one. Controlling the train from there, they detached car one. the blackout and shaking, and the power source was switched over to the backup system. So when the train shook, was there or was there not jiggling in my blouse? Take a guess. While the detached car one was running on a separate track, the culprit went to work, preparing to disguise car one as car five. What about the jiggling? Yes! First, Aphex's corpse was carried to the corridor, and the necklace removed earlier was placed back on. Then, the car one number plate was burned... ...so that it couldn't be properly identified. With everything in place... ...the culprit went into the main control room, locked the door, and waited for the train cars to reconnect. Well, this time, the culprit was riding in car one on the other track, right? Yeah, the train, which was only cars two, three, and four at the time, remained on course. Since we were in a tunnel, I didn't even realize car one was moving alongside us. The train we were on went through the tunnel with only three cars. When it came out of the tunnel, the car with the culprit in it attached to car four. Now behind car four, that car became car five. The swap was pre-programmed into the train's automatic operating system, right? Technology sure is convenient. The culprit, riding in car one, 
attached it to the back of car four. That caused more shaking, but there was no blackout this time because the power supply stayed the same. Additional shaking occurred inside my blouse, but the power stayed on. For the love of God, girl. After that, I mistook car one for car five and walked right in. The culprit wrecked it so much, I didn't even notice the door I had smashed when I was in car one before. I figured there'd been some kind of brawl. But that was part of the culprit's plan, wasn't it? Also, no one would realize it was actually car one. When I found the corpse, I deduced that it was Aphex from the necklace it had on. I was just rediscovering the same charred corpse from car one. The disguised corpse and the car switch completely fooled me. Reusing a dead body? Oh, this is a despairingly brilliant idea! When the train arrived in Kanai Ward, it connected to a different, prearranged car one. And with that, the train once again had Five cars. So much attaching and detaching. What a stupid, crazy, elaborate trick! Keepers were lying in wait at the station. As the sole survivor, I was set up as the one responsible for the murders. And Amaterasu was in on it! <sighs> that really turns me on! What? We got the horny demon. This yeah, we did. Off, right? Welcome to the new people that are watching. During that time, the culprit stayed hidden in the main control room of the disguised car one. And waited for the peacekeepers to haul you in, Master. They were right there at the scene. After burning all the master detectives, the culprit faked their own death and tried to frame me as the killer. It was a cunning, cold-blooded scheme. And the evildoer who committed these countless contemptible crimes is none other than... Silch Alexander! It was you! The fucking anime pointing. Yep. We're going all in with all the wonderful, wonderful tapping. Oh god, the the pointing that has like weight to it. But you know you love it. Uh, I could do it without it. But where would you see it? Wait a minute, are we gonna stab him for real now? Maybe. Oh no. We're back in the Is shit again. that it? What's this? It's the truth. It's the soul of the true culprit who made this mystery labyrinth. The soul of the true culprit? Persona 5 called. Wait, what I'm gonna take to your soul! Now it's time for the main event! I wonder if he's gonna realize he has a god of death with him and what that means. Here we go! Probably it's my not. time to shine! He's going to do awful horny things to that. Surging bloodlust. Overflowing despair. If this turns into a fucking yep, nope, I knew it was gonna turn into a fucking J-pop video. No, we're going Sailor Moon, bitch. Oh, it's alive. Whoever did the sound mixing for this, fuck you. Don't make the music louder than the voice.
Well, he got blown up. We broke his soul. We broke this world. We did. We solved the mystery. We're going to be solving a lot of them. Collapse a pocket dimension, kill all the people that fucking live there. They're just spirits. They don't matter. Spirit lives don't matter. Oh, uh huh? We're back? What, are you what the fuck are you supposed to do that? now? These motherfuckers are in on it. shouldn't be broken yet. The peacekeepers will take care of you. We have all the time in the world. Unless huh? now he can do, like, massive ninja huh? skills. Shinigami! Where are you? Nothing here's changed. What's going on? Shinigami? Are you listening? Get him! Oh, you know what? She probably is gonna take over that guy's body. Maybe. Wait! I know who the culprit is! What? I love the smoke. It's so stupid. It's Zilch! He's still alive. He framed me! <laughs> What are you talking about? He's already dead. Huh? But... Shut up! This is not up for discussion! Uh, what a waste of time! Take him away! You're after Kung Fu fight. Shinigami! Where did you go? This isn't what's supposed to happen! So kick him in the balls and run. Yeah. God, you creepy Here's fuck. When you panic, so I had to enjoy the view for a bit. Stop playing around. Why hasn't the situation changed at all? He must be hallucinating. Hmm. Taking him down shouldn't be a problem. Take him away. What? He's dead. Looks like it's over. Huh? What's over? Shinigami, what's going on? There's always a price to pay. When I read the soul of the true culprit, the mystery labyrinth created by the culprit is destroyed. And but you kill them? Place, the source that created the mystery labyrinth also perishes. <laughs> we just murdered him! <laughs> The source perishes? Don't we need him to, you know, tell people he did? God. Nope, apparently this is just how it works now. We're just fucking spirits of vengeance. Fuck yeah. That's but a lot more cops the culprit dies. Then that report saying Silch, the true culprit, was dead. And that solves today's mystery. The true culprit is as dead as a doornail. We needed him alive, Shinigami! You're now innocent and free to go, Master! A happy ending! A roll credits! How do I know you're not just fucking with me this entire time to get certain outcomes because you want everybody else to die and you want to eat souls? A little of a, yeah, probably. There's nothing happy about this! Zilch died because I solved the mystery, right? Huh? He was a dangerous murderer who killed four master detectives. He deserved to die. I mean, I don't think I'm completely free to go. Not even with Zilch being dead. In that case, say exactly what I'm about to tell you to that gilded idiot over there. Okay. Swank, did you just receive a report that Zilch was dead? How did you know that? I thought so. Ah! If he was alive until moments ago, that changes things about this case. Someone who died in front of our... my... eyes... was alive. 
This is clearly an attempt by the culprit to disguise the truth. Don't tell me the peacekeepers lied to try to cover up what really happened. And you didn't try to frame an innocent person, did you? What? What? You think you can weasel your way out of this? Yes. You better not forget you're in Kanai Ward now! You're powerless before the might of the Amaterasu Corporation! No, um, I didn't mean... Hey! Don't surrender so easily! You were so close! That does it! You're under arrest! That... that thing. Listen, you got no right to remain silent, and you got no right to call a lawyer either! Take him away! No, oh, wait! Hold on! Hold on just a second! Hey, excuse me, do you have a minute? You! It's all good. Let's stop all the fighting. We both have to follow orders from the higher-ups, so let's not do anything that causes unnecessary tension. Falsifying evidence and testimonies is a drag when it comes time to do the paperwork, right? It's tough keeping things consistent. Just forget about all that and leave it to me, yeah? You know, I saw that the true culprit was alive and well just a bit ago. What? If you let us go, I'll cook something up in my report to the World Detective Organization. You don't want trouble, right? If the WDO floods this joint because of you. Your punishment might be kind of brutal. So, you know what to do. Leave things well enough alone, as they say. Let's go! <sighs> Thank goodness that worked out. Who is he? Beats me? All right, so let me start the next one.